my second talk was about m surgical management of ingrained toenails. And um, there are two approaches for dealing with uh, ingrained toenail. is either narrowing the nail plate or working on the soft tissue, debulking the soft tissue. For narrowing the nail plate, the best is to use chemical cautery and especially phenol, which is very safe, gives 95% of success rate, and is very comfortable for the patient afterwards. Uh, the second point is you can also narrow the nail with your blade, but this is painful because you have to cut and put stitches, but it works in skill hands. But we, the, the Cochrane database really highly recommends phenolization, so chemical cautery for narrowing the nail plates. The second option, when you have a chronic ingrowing, which is swelling of the proximal fold, you can just debulk. You can just first uh, debulk and suture, which is either the Noel technique, but you just remove a wedge of uh, uh, flesh vertically skimming to the bone and just reapproximate the, the, the borders, or a horizontal wedge, which is the Dubois. Then you can just uh, depress and debulk the uh, soft tissue. The last approach is just debulking and letting heal by sagarine tension. This is very interesting if you're not a skilled surgeon and you can do the super U, which is the Brazilian technique where you remove the whole flesh around the nail unit and let it heal by sagarine tension. It takes about eight weeks, so you have to inform your patient. Or you just can debulk just laterally and leave the uh, tip of the finger, which is the Vandenbos technique, which gives also fantastic results.